Georgia and I chose to do a working holiday in the US with international working holidays. I went to the Ritz-Carlton Lake Econi in Georgia and I got to work with multiple roles within the food and beverage sector in my time there. I loved how welcoming everyone was when I first got to America. Being the first New Zealander and the only New Zealander at the Lake Econi location at the time, everyone was just so welcoming and it made me feel so much more comfortable and confident and it just made me feel more at home. So we live about 10 minutes away from work and there is a shuttle that takes us to and from work and back home again and they do come at set times throughout the day. So every second house has six people and three bedrooms and every other house has four people and two bedrooms. So you will be sharing a room, so there will be two people in the room. And then depending on which house you get, there will be either four or six in that house. The houses are new, so they are quite tidy. And every room comes with a bathroom and a wardrobe. And then there is a downstairs shared kitchen and living space. Everything is fully furnished, so there's no furniture you need to bring. Everything is already in the house. I learned that I was able to be independent and not to rely on my parents or my family for things that I needed. So if there was something I needed or wanted, then I'd have to go and get it myself or I'd have to go and do it myself. There was no, I couldn't just call out my mum and be like, hey mum, can you get me this? Like I would have to go and do it myself. And I also learned so much more about myself and it's just amazing at like what a year away can do like for your mental health and it was just amazing like I learned so much about my work ethic I learned so much more about like friendships I learned so much more just about who I am as a person um which is yeah it's the best feeling so I got to go to Chicago to visit my auntie for about a week and then I went down to Savannah which is about three and a half hours down from Atlanta I got to go there for a couple of days just to look around I did go to Hollywood after my placement had finished for three days and that was really cool to go. I was busy working throughout the year so I wasn't really interested in really going anywhere else but if you want to go somewhere just talk to management team and they'll be able to sort you out in doing that. I was quite confident in going over although I did have a little worry about safety but I can guarantee you that it is 100% safe. If you don't put yourself in an unsafe situation, then you'll be completely fine. It's pretty much the same. You just have to be aware of like where you are, who you're with, what you're doing, um, and you'll be fine. I wasn't really homesick at all during my year away. I actually loved being independent and away from home. I did miss my family and I kept in contact with them via messenger and video calls and phone calls. The hardest thing for homesickness is probably getting through that first month. I wasn't really homesick, but I did have roommates that were. My advice is to limit contact with your family for the first two weeks that you're there. So don't video chat with them. Don't call them. You're more than welcome to message them and like keep them updated with like what you're doing and where you are, but don't call them. Don't call them um, because you're more likely to miss them. The more contact you have with your family, the more likely you are to miss them. And then the more likely you are to be like, no, I shouldn't be here. I want to go home. I miss my family too much. So if you limit that contact you have and actually experience everything for what it is, then you're going to be fine. Um, and just getting over the first month is probably the hardest. Once you're over that first month and you're settled in, then you're going to go, oh, this is easy. I love it here. And so just limit contact for that first two weeks and you should be fine. Thank you all for watching. And I hope that if you do decide to do a working holiday with International Working Holidays, that you have the best time of your life and that you learn so much about yourself and the culture and America and you just have so much fun. And maybe I'll see you all in America soon.